Good morning guys. Before we get into it, I want to talk to you about the sponsor of today's video, which is actually Orate. And if you've been following me for a while, you know I wear Orate all the time. It's this ring that I have on every single day. I shower in it. I keep it on all the time because it's such good quality. I just placed another order actually because it's been a while since I placed an order. Just because they are such high quality pieces, you don't have to be constantly getting new jewelry. I've had the ring that I'm wearing right now for almost a year. I shower in it, like I said, and I just love the quality of Orate. That's why I love working with them. Also, if you guys don't know, they're actually a woman-owned business, so they're by women for women. And I just love the messaging of the company and I get so excited to work with them because I love what they stand for And also if you didn't know they started working with Klarna Which means you can buy now but pay over time So it just makes it super accessible to have really really high quality pieces for a lower price Also, they gave me a discount code for you guys to use which is just Caitlin my name I'll spell it so you guys don't forget that there's two ends, but it's just oratenewyork.com slash Caitlin or it is a u r a t e new york.com slash Caitlin you'll get 20% off and and that's such a good deal especially for high quality jewelry that getting it for 20% off is such a good deal so don't forget to use my code thank you so much Orate for sponsoring today's video and let's get into it ready for my day today is the day that we're getting a new car and I'm also I have plans tonight with my friends to go get sushi so I'm getting ready for the day I decided to just get ready earlier in the day instead of getting ready late I, hello <laughs> I thought I would just turn the camera on as I get ready I've been liking showing you guys my makeup routine let me know if you guys want to see an updated makeup routine so I've been doing very like glowy makeup, minimal makeup. But anyway, I'm meeting my dad at 12 o'clock today to go get a new car, hopefully. I mean, I don't wanna jinx it, but we did go yesterday to this dealership and test drove some cars and we found one that was like a really, really good deal. But it just still doesn't feel real, especially because I've never purchased anything like this before for myself. And also with that being said, I have to say thank you so much for literally no matter how you support me if you follow me on instagram if you watch my youtube videos comment on anything i just want you to know i'm so grateful for you because i wouldn't be able to one purchase a car by myself without you but also do this job in general and it's something that brings me so much joy it's obviously not about like the car or like treating myself anything like that i do think it's important to treat yourself hold on but i mean if you guys watch my channel you know that the reason that i even post videos or podcasts is just to help inspire you guys and hopefully help you with your mindset and make sure that it's in a positive place rather than anywhere negative which i know a lot of social media can be toxic in that way especially in like the fitness and wellness industry so that's why i started and it's been like two years since i posted my first tiktok and i can't believe like where it's gotten today and I'm just so grateful and I can't even believe that this is my job. So it's more about that. But I also am really, really excited about buying a new car. Hunter and I share a car and the car that we drive now is so cute. It's a Kia Sorento. I love it. It's like my personality trait because I've driven it for so long. And it was like the first car I like took my license test in because it used to be my mom's. And yeah, it's just like my personality. So I'm sad to see it go. But with that being said, the radio doesn't work. The head thing like always falls off and hits me in the head when we're like on the freeway and the back seat doesn't go up it's just like a lot there's a lot wrong with it so it's definitely time and i waited a really long time to get a new car like i've been pushing this process out for like a year until it was like okay i should really like sell my car when it has some sort of worth to it before it like really breaks but that's the plan but yeah i'm gonna finish up getting ready make my breakfast and then we will go to the car appointment
before I go change, I want to show you this life hack. I saw it on TikTok and I've been doing it ever since. But apparently, like, your best lip shade should be the color that you use for your eyebrows as the lip liner and then the color that you use for your blush as the lipstick shade. So that's what I've been doing lately and I love how it turns out. I have a liquid blush. Let me see if I can find it. Not a liquid blush, it's a putty blush. And the combo just makes it look so good. And then over top I do the Fenty Lip Plumper. And the combo always looks really good. So that's what I've been doing lately. I've gotten a few questions asking like what my lip combo has been. And that's what I've been doing, so. Okay, I just got the Fenty Heat Lip Plumper. Okay, I think I'm gonna wear these aloe like cargo pants. They're so freaking cute. They have the little aloe sign right here. I love them. They're so cute. The fit is really good. It's like not high rise, but it's also not low rise. And it's like the perfect baggy. I don't know what size I got. Okay, I got a small in these. I definitely could have done a medium if I wanted them a little bit more oversized or low wa low waisted, but I just prefer a little bit higher waisted. I'm gonna wear these today. I don't know what top yet. on the outfit i just decided to do this little bodysuit just a tank top from zara but these are the pants when they're on i'm gonna put on my dunks and that's the outfit so i'll take you guys with me for the day i don't think i'm gonna have time to get starbucks so i think after i'll probably get like something because it's probably gonna be like 3 p.m i'm very excited so let's go look at how nice it looks dad mom you're just back there normally that'll be coco's head <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Does it feel comfortable in the car? Like, yeah. Does it feel like you're good for your size? Mm -hmm. Does it feel good for your mm -hmm. size, like Hunter? Yeah. Maybe you should let Dad. Dad's taking her for a spin. Wait, Dad, I don't think you've ever been on my YouTube channel. Never. You haven't? Mm -hmm. Ever? Never. You want As mom? <laughs> yeah. Hello. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> this is really nice. Yeah, he's taking it for a spin. Yay. He'll be the real test because I know nothing about cars. Okay, we're in a little bit bigger of a car and I'm having issues committing. <laughs> it's bigger or newer. They're both. I know. That's literally, that's they're, the options. Bigger or newer. relative in terms of everything else. Everything. How they look, how they. The price. All I know is I want to go eat a sandwich right now. I'll make you one. Mm -hmm. All right. How's your first car buying experience, Caitlin, in a dealership? Scary. It'd be worse if you guys weren't here. Yeah. Insert Hunter here. <laughs> it's a lot of money to spend. It's a big decision. But it's a cute car. Do you like it? Yes. Do you want to buy it? Yes. Will I though? We'll Will find you? out. <laughs> to we'll, be determined. We're going to see how good your negotiating skills are. We'll see if I've taught you well. I'll just stay quiet. My parents will do the rest. Silence is power in negotiating. Let's swap it. Do you like the car? Yeah, I think it's really cute. My mom's just excited because they have a cappuccino machine. Yes. <laughs> Wait, did you? Oh, it looked empty at first. Really oh, it not. smells so good. Did you put, like, what's in a cappuccino? Cream. Uh, steamed cream. Steamed cream. I mean, hot as a mother. It's very hot. Mmm, that's like really tongue. good. It's, they're good with vanilla, too. <laughs> it smells so oh, good. I'll make you a vanilla one. No, I had two coffees today already. They're empty cap. Are they empty cap? I think they are. Six hours later, and <laughs> we got the car. Next clip, we'll actually be in the car. Okay, I'm about to run out the door because I'm going to dinner with my friends, but I wanted to show the final outfit of the night. I'm wearing this top that I was wearing earlier today while I was getting ready from Princess Polly. I actually want to pull it out a little bit more. This leather jacket is also from Princess Polly and then these jeans are from Revolve and then these shoes are Zara. But with heels because my outfit's a little bit more casual so I wanted to dress it up. Bag is also from Princess Polly. Get my hair in a little clip and we're ready to go. We're gonna go to Culinary Dropout, I think. I know I go there in like every single video but it's my favorite restaurant and it's close to us. 
So, we were supposed to do sushi, but one of the girls already had sushi like yesterday, so she was like, can we switch? So we're probably just gonna go to culinary. Here's a bit. I keep dropping everything. Okay. Let's go. Thumbnail? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh um, god, I really I need water. Pale. I have had like no water it today. Washes mm -hmm. you. But really, I can't wait for the pretzels. Yeah. I know, I was gonna, I was wondering I get what you guys were gonna pretzels. get. Ooh, that's what we should do. What do you normally get? The chili, the curry. or not the chili. I kinda want you to I get it because I wanna curry. try it. Oh, there you go. No, because it's like hot. I was thinking about doing something I'm cold. I'm literally locked back here still. <laughs> I will open it. Okay, well, we'll see you guys at dinner. We'll show you what we get. Don't also, we have another friend coming. Her name's Emma. Good girl. I just, <laughs> I just, uh, sorry, it's the easiest spot right there. the camera. I just got home with my friends, from my friends, or from culinary with my friends, and now we're just probably gonna go get some ice cream, take the car out. We also wanted to see how Coco would be in her hammock, because in our last car we just had the, like, crate. She's doing good. She's doing really good. But I'll show you guys what we ended up getting for ice cream. Also, so you guys can see the nighttime mode. I love how this car has, like, lights and you can change the colors. We just don't know how to change the colors yet. <laughs> but it looks really cool. Hi, baby. Hi, baby girl. Okay, well, we're gonna get some ice cream. Where are we going, babe? Sweet Republic. Your faves. Mm -hmm. Your faves. <laughs> yeah, our faves. Okay, Hunter and Coco are waiting in the car because it's just like a lot getting her in and out of the car, but she actually was doing so well in the car. I'm very pleasantly surprised because usually she goes in her crate and obviously she's good in her crate, but we're going, or I'm getting us some Sweet Republic. It's the best ice cream if you're ever in the Phoenix area. It's the best. I'm back. They gave us a bag. They gave us some ice in here. Ice? Yeah. I don't know which is which. You know, There's no better way to end the night than with ice cream. True. Look at her. She literally looks so cute. I love her haircut. At first, we were not a fan. <laughs> like, when we first got her haircut, we were like, shoot. We cut her hair way too short, and we, like, felt bad. But now I actually like it short. Yeah, girl, really It fast. just, it took some getting used to, because for a while, her hair grew so long, because she couldn't get groomed. But, if you come to Sweet Republic, get the Almond Butter Crunch. That one's the best. What do you think? Almond Butter Crunch is definitely the best one by far. I'm about to do some skincare. This little set that I'm wearing is from Easy Sundays. I'll show you the back, it's really cute, if you can see. And they have the cutest like PJ sets, loungewear sets, I really, really love them. So, I will link that, but I'm gonna do some skincare. I'll try and show you my current skincare routine as I talk. So this is the Summer Fridays moisturizer. I've been trying to transition all my skincare to clean skincare, especially because I have pretty sensitive skin. But, oh my god, today was literally the best day. Like, not even the fact that I just got a car, which is really, really exciting. Like, I don't know if I looked excited in all the clips just because I was kind of stressed. Just because, one, I always feel stressed when I'm spending money. And two, it was just like a really big decision and we were deciding between cars. So please don't think that I'm not excited. I'm so excited. But even just on top of that, like, hanging out with my parents all day, it's always like so fun. When it's me, my mom, and my dad, we always just like joke a bunch. And it was a full day thing. It was literally, we were there for like six hours. And then rushing home, showing Hunter the car. I didn't film his reaction just because, I don't know, I just like wanted him to enjoy the moment or whatever. And so I didn't vlog his reaction, but you guys got to see him drive it later on. He loves the car. Obviously he's gonna be driving the car just as much as me. We share a car. I don't know if I said in the beginning, but I didn't buy a new car. I bought a certified pre-owned vehicle. By the way, the eye cream that I was using is um, the Shawnee Darden eye cream. I will link it. It's literally one of my favorite products I've ever, ever owned. That's what it looks like. Now I'm using the CEO Sunday Riley Vitamin C Brightening Serum. But yeah, like I was saying, it was just so fun hanging out with my parents. And then going to dinner with my friends. I freaking love those girls. And yeah, I just feel very grateful. I don't even know what to say. But thank you guys so much for watching today's video. The next video is going to be a spring reset routine. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me today. And I will see you in my next video.
and when you go on Instagram and you're on YouTube, it just looks like everyone has all of these friends and they're always doing things. And I, you might even feel that way about me. You know, I'm always meeting new people with this job and hanging out with people. I just want you to know that there was a point in my life where I literally was like, how do I make friends? I just went through this period of time where I felt like I was never going to make friends. I was never going to find a group like I had in high school. And it was so sad. Like, it, I just want to, like, go back and hug myself and say, like, you will find your friends. And it also has nothing to do with you. Anything on the outside like that, remind yourself that...